Good morning, you two pipe smokers. Anyway, continuing on to this uh, moisture situation. Uh, pipe check, by the way. Got a new uh, Bribia uh, filtered pipe. Um, in any case, uh, I, I tested this out with 1Q. Uh, remember I showed the 1Q I had 18% uh, uh, moisture according to that little meter I have. So I smoked the bowl complete in a normal fas fashion. I uh, didn't get it too hot. And then I checked the 9mm Dr. Uh, Pearl filter about three or four minutes after I put the pipe down. And I checked the moisture of the filter and the filter was 15%. So that's somewhat inter interesting. Um, I suspect as you smoke some tobacco, the, the fire or heat dries up some of the moisture. Some of it gets trapped in the filter. Um, so the filter paper measured 15%. So what I gather from that is that's the amount of moisture that came out of the 18% tobacco that you would have inhaled which can possibly cause that dreadful tongue bite um, I don't know if any saliva contributed to the filter um, I have no way of measuring that um, I would say no but I'm sure I know it, it can um, but I wasn't puffing on it hard enough I don't think to cause that but you never know so some of the percentage could be from moisture from me but what I think is interesting is the moisture did not increase so it's a portion of the tobacco moisture um, of course like everything else continue testing which I will do and see if that becomes a standard or if the moisture actually can exceed what the tobacco going in was I don't know the answer to that question. That's why we're doing this. Um, take away what you may from this. Um, it just adds to the complete puzzle of smoking pipes and how there's so many variables um, that need to be addressed, I guess, um, to try to understand what's actually happening. But it's fun and uh, I enjoy doing it, and I will continue to do so and see what we get out of it. Thanks, guys. Thanks for the comments. Thanks for watching. I uh, appreciate it, and uh, we'll catch you on the next one. Thank you.